All right, so this is a quick one. I wanted to show a consideration in Dynamo Player for 2020 and older. I know that sounds kind of odd, but this came up on the forum, so I wanted to show it. So if you have Dynamo Player in Revit 2020 or older, and you have a graph, so in this case, I'll do edit on this delete stuff graph that does something. So we'll select a few elements. In Dynamo, if I hit run, I'm not afraid because this is frozen. So that's just a thing within Dynamo that we'll do. So we'll save this and we'll go ahead and hit run in Dynamo Player now and let's see what happens. So in Dynamo Player, I tend to not be nervous about that because I know it was frozen. But as you can see, it actually went through and worked. So if we undo that, and it might take a couple undos here, and I select some additional elements. Let's say I have a graph that has a whole branch frozen and I'm expecting that not to run. It's still running even though it's frozen. So that's in Revit 2020. If I close Dynamo Player here and I open Revit 21, and we'll open that same graph. So as you can see, I still have the same graph mapped in 21. That node is still frozen. So let's take a look at that. That node exists and it's frozen. So I'll close Dynamo. In this case, I'll go ahead and make sure I select some new things. I'm going to hit play and that's fixed in 21. So between Revit 20 and 21, that was patched. Uh, these are the specific versions I'm in, 2021.1.6. And the one I'm in for 2020 is 2020.2.5. So I don't know if that makes a difference. But that has been patched as of Revit 21, which is great news. I don't know why that wasn't announced. Uh, but yeah, if you're in 2020 or older, it is definitely an issue. So I thought I would share that. Thanks.